What support settings are you using? Please give me your support settings. What kind of support settings are you using? So today I'm going to show you the support settings I use for those prints, but first I'm gonna have to tell you that you are asking the wrong questions because I think the more appropriate question here would be what kind of filament are you using? And what I'm using is just a regular matte gray soling uh, by Creality. And you can still pick this up under 10 bucks per roll when you buy 10 rolls, which is a crazy good value. And the first secret of support removal lies right over here, matte. You can see I have tons of filament everywhere and I tested this theory out many, many times. And the conclusion is always the same. Matte filaments are always going to be easier when it comes to support removal compared to regular filaments and especially compared to silks. And I'm not saying it's always the case, but if you're expecting any of the filaments to fuse and ruin your prints, it's going to be silk. And when it comes to matte filaments, this one is extremely cheap. And every single time I used it, the supports basically just disintegrate and the prints come out absolutely perfect. And I tested this on multiple printers. This one was printed on Creality K2+. This one was printed on Creality High. And this one was printed on Bamboo A1. Every single one of them from two feet away looks basically like resin. The thing that's going to give it away instantly is obviously the top layers. I'm using just 0.2 millimeters, regular layers, no adaptive heights of any kind, just straight up set up and print. And the top layers are probably most visible here because of his big bald head. So yeah, if you don't believe me, use my links or don't. Go to Amazon, go to Creality website, check it on TikTok. I really don't care, just pick up one of these and test it out for yourself and I can guarantee you're going to be surprised and for the support settings like I said just standard layer height I use 7% gyroid infill and for supports auto trees on build plate only remove small overhangs that's it no tricks no secret stuff just well calibrated printer and good filament